hi welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are doing a savings challenge video these are honestly my favorite ones and you will see why so we are cash stuffing at two hundred and ten dollars and I'm just gonna put this to the side as my little cheat sheet so as you can see all the money is laid out here but it is a little dusty but I want to show you this because I have told you in the past that I was working on a cash tray and this is just the prototype and you'll see why so I don't know hopefully my camera is yes it is picking it up so I am making a cash tray that is a Nintendo um, controller and as you can see the slats are a little too thin and that's why I haven't been using it yet but I honestly I'm just super excited so me and my boyfriend had bought a 3d printer in the past and he's since upgraded it a lot so I think the next one will be a lot more smooth on the back and you can see here that it dented a little bit but I, overall I'm really really happy with it and I honestly just want to use it in this video so that's what we're gonna do and it will definitely allow me more space so the money's supposed to lay like this but you'll see I don't know if the ones will fit in here but that is my little dilemma. The slots are just a little too thin, so we have to do some adjustments because I don't think, well, these ones might fit in here. It's going to be a little tight, so we're going to split them up. And I honestly wasn't going to use this because it's not painted. I'm going to paint it and everything, but I'm just, I'm too excited about it. So this is the prototype. So that's how it looks. I might put the money so that it like lays a little bit more on a diagonal. But yeah, that is my little cash tray. So I'm going to put this on the side and we will get right into our challenges. Okay, so I think the only one we have left to color in is the 26 week challenge. I think we finished basically everything else. So the, today we are doing number 60 and I'm going to get a different marker because I don't want to I want to keep it oops excuse me I want to keep it fresh so let's use a green I haven't used the green in a while and I'm gonna put something underneath it because it does go through how's everybody doing today I'm feeling a lot better still might be sounding a little bit congested but the sun is out and it is gorgeous so I decided to film today and I love doing savings challenges if you have not yet um, checked out my little debt update debt confession kind of video hey guys I just wanted to pause the video right here because I did record this in um, in the past so this is a little bit late and I just want to say thank you so so much for your love and support on my last video about the death confession I honestly didn't expect to hear such lovely kind thoughts from you guys and just the support that I got from you honestly like hit me at the best time and I did cry a little not gonna lie because you guys are so sweet so I just wanted to pop in here and say thank you so much and if you if you uh, commented on that video, there's, you just made my day. So thank you so much. Take care. And check that out. I am thinking about focusing more on savings challenges because I want to complete them. Therefore, I will not touch the money. So I'm thinking maybe I'll do more of that. And that way I'll like, once I'm done with a challenge, I will stuff it into my binders. Kind of how like, um, Veronica from 40 plus life does it she's definitely the wing it queen but I would love to kind of baby steps into that It'd be kind of fun so that's it for our savings challenge and now we will stuff it in this is by Chris budgets if you do not know and she's over on Etsy as Chris prints it So let's go into my binder. I kind of want to change up my binder for the new year, but 
we'll see how that goes. I'm just still so in love with my anime themed binder here that I made. And we're going to add $60 into... Oh, how fun. I have a little cash tray. Sorry, I'm just so excited. <laughs> so we're going to add $60 into yearly. And now it has $500, $600, $700 in the bank. $20, oh, $50, $70, $80. So 780 in our yearly challenge. And this is going to be going out, uh, going towards my moving expenses for the new year. So that's it for yearly. Next up is our Four Seasons Challenge, and we are completing it. Super excited, because that means we can start our uh, Winter Challenge soon. And this is uh, a challenge over from Abby Tries to Budget. So I'm going to color in the last 30. Very sloppily, but it will be colored in. Okay, so that's it for our Autumn Savings Challenge, and now we can see how much we have all together. So now in our Autumn Savings Challenge, we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 140, 150, 160, and 165 in our Autumn Savings Challenge. So... I'm going to be using this money for my anime convention that's coming up in December and I think I'm going to do a little separate um, cash stuffing with uh, my cosplay anime binder so look forward to that because I am and the next time you see this the winter savings challenge will be in there. So next up is a new challenge and it, it co comes from it comes from Mel from Mystic Budgets and it's called Goth Baby. Uh, secretly, I always wanted to be a goth, um, like dress gothic and stuff like that, especially when I was in high school. But mm, wasn't really uh, a part of the ways of my mom. She never really let me wear anything with skulls on it and stuff like that. So, you know. Now I can do it, <laughs> but being goth is very hard. You have to wear a lot like makeup and dress it, and I am so poor. I can't afford all the cool goth stuff. So we're just going to pretend I'm a goth baby <laughs> because I love the savings challenge. So we are going to stuff in at $5 today, and every symbol is $5, every bat is 10 and it saves me 160 so we're going to start off with the little bow here and I'm just going to color in the white spaces. There we go. So we have our first one colored in and I'm going to put in the $5. I'm super excited about this challenge and I love, love, love the envelope. When she gave this to me, she also uh, put in extra bats and a heart, and I definitely put those on my binders, and it looks so cute. So next up is our concert savings challenge. This, if you have, if you caught the other video, you'll know that I just bought some very expensive concert tickets, and so this uh, here saves up $365 so I'll have to do it twice because I bought two tickets so it was around a little over $600 so I'm using this to pay mis myself back on my credit card so today we are gonna do $5 and see a microphone is $5 and a music note is $5 I I feel I feel in the black marker so I'm gonna do a music note so thank you so much Mel I really love these challenges and I just like can't wait to complete them so it'll definitely keep me motivated and I love this envelope it says music saves lives so now we have five dollars in there I did also purchase two more of her savings challenges but and they're the digital ones <clears throat> so I did do spooky yet cute. I know it's past Halloween, but I still really love it and I want to do it. 
This saves $80. I might start this um, next month, even though it's going to be Christmas time. I'm going to be that rebel. <laughs> and then I also got her Taurus challenge because I am a Taurus and I love, love, love Zodiac challenges. So this one saves $123. So I'm not gonna start. I'm probably not gonna start this one until the new year, and I'll use this towards my birthday fund. So those are two of her other challenges I bought. The son decided to leave me, so now we are um, going to the next one. So this is a new challenge as well. I'm not gonna be stuffing it, but it's called the Gas Up Challenge by Budgeting Dolls. And basically, how it works is that you figure out how many gallons you put in your gas tank. So mine is 13. So I'll write that in later. And then for each state, you look up how much the gas is there, and then you multiply that by your gallons, and that's what you save in your um, gas up challenge. So I'm very, very excited to start this. It's very unique, and I really love Budgeting Dolls channel. So go ahead and check her out, and also check out Mystic Budgets. Mel is amazing as well. So not signing this today, but I will be soon. And the same thing goes for this little mini $50 mini challenge by Kimberly Budgets, also a great channel. Um, she's having a little sale right now. I don't know if it'll still be on by the time this video goes up, but I decided to snag this little boba drink challenge. It's very manageable and something I can easily accomplish. So we have that. So next up, I know I'm like, I'm trying to trying to talk as fast as I can before my video goes. So our dollar challenge is going to get $3 because that's what was left in my wallet. And I don't count this until the end of the year, so very exciting. And then our $5 challenge is also going to get 2 And I'm still working on um, just filling this back in because I did use this for my trip so I'm not going to be marking off anything but I am going to be putting in two fives so now it has 5, 10, 15, 20 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 in our five dollar challenge so this is kind of quickly accumulating it's pretty cool and then our 1k challenge by Vanilla Budgets is going to receive twenty dollars today this challenge is definitely going towards debt for sure so now I'm trying to work on each row at a time and so now I'm going to be putting in another 20 and I did get rid of my utilities envelope and it had <clears throat> it had $15 so I put one five dollar into my Five dollars savings challenge, and the other ten went into this one k. So now we have twenty, forty, sixty, and seventy dollars in our one k challenge. I'm think I'm thinking I'm liking it so far. I feel like we've only done five spaces, and it's already seventy dollars. So that's perfect. So that's it for our one k challenge. So cute. And then next up is our twenty five week challenge, and by Alba, and I'm gonna be doing $10 and $11 and then I'm also going to be doing 22 because my water bill came out to be $77 and I decided that with the extra money because I saved 100 for it I'm going to be putting it into here because this is going to be going towards my February convention and I would love to complete this as quickly as possible but these are so cute and I don't know if she has mini binders on her Etsy but definitely go check her out and she's always linked down below honestly all the channels that I support are like super awesome and they are worth checking out such lovely ladies another 11 here oh that's a nice one let's put a gross one so there's 10 or 11 and then we're gonna skip ahead I figured since I had $22 I just stuff it in here Two. all right so that's $22 so yay, I'm hoping I can finish this before then. So that's it for Alba's 
mini challenge and it's getting pretty full already. So that's that. And then I am going to be starting Mel's uh, Mystery 15 not this month, but next month. So that's her box challenge. And that's it for this binder. Next up is going to be this little Mystery 16 from Alba over at Unique Life. I did scratch off 24, so that's what we're going to be putting in here. So we're going to scratch off another one. I'm running out of time on my thing, so hopefully it doesn't cut me off. I've been very chatty. Okay, so next week is going to be, or next paycheck is going to be 12, which is awesome. So that'll be the next one I do. And I'll stick these back in here. So that's it for that. And then we are going to do my mini savings challenges by the Little Helpful Files. And we're going to put $15 into self care. And this is going to go towards massage. So I'm going to do another blush and a green brush. Super, super cute. I love these. So I did condense it because it was getting a little crazy. So there we go, 10, 15. So now it has 20, 40, 60, 75, which is great. My total amount for this is 270. There we go. And then last but not least is going to be my box but here by amethyst budgets and it's going to be getting nine dollars so i picked out a three of diamonds so this should be nine five six seven eight nine perfect so i hope you enjoyed this video i'm going to wrap it up here because i have 50 seconds to say goodbye to you guys I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you do, please give it a thumbs up, and also comment down below, hmm, what is your favorite candle scent? I know, very random, but we're getting into the holiday season, and I love the smell of pine at candles, so I'm very excited for that, and if you're not already subscribed, please hit the subscribe button and join my channel if you'd like, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!